Hello everyone. Today we're gonna solve a problem from the textbook Renewable and Efficient Electric Power Systems. Chapter 6, Wind Power System. Problem number 6.2. An anemometer mounted at a height of 10 meter above surface with crops, hedges and chops shows a wind speed of 5 meter per second, assuming 15 Kelvin. 15 degree and one atmosphere pressure determine the following for a wind turbine with hub height 60 meter and rotor diameter of 60 meter. Estimate A, estimate the wind speed and the specific, specific power in the wind at the highest point that a rotor blade reaches. Where is it? 90 meter. The B repeat A at the lowest point at which blades fall, whereas the lowest point is 30 meter. And we have 10 here, H naught, we have V naught 5 meter per second, and we got the H from 30 meter and 90 meter, and also we have alpha crops, hedges, and sharps. We got the on to alpha here. here high crops hedges and sharps 0 0.20 it's alpha so let's solve for a we have rho here we have v naught rho is uh, air density we have v naught 5 h naught 10 we need for a so we go with h equal 90 the highest so V V ninety equal five times H ninety over ten alpha zero point zero one twenty equal Seven point seven five nine meter over second. And got, got power ninety equal half rho v cubed equal half. We have constant one point twenty two two five times 7.759 in parenthesis cubed equal 286 watt over meter squared for B we need A but for the lowest, so we get the speed V30 equal 5 30 over 10 but alpha 0.20 and that's equal 622 9 meter over second and power 30 equal half times constant 1.225 times 6.229 cubed equal 100 48 watt per meter squared. Okay, for C, compare the ratio of wind power at the two elevation using results of A and B, and compare that with the ratio obtained using 6.17. Okay, 
see the ratio of power top to power to is power ratio equal the highest 286 over 148 and that's equal 1.93 1.93 and he said in the question using 6.17 6.17 is a rule power over power not equal h over h not r three times alpha and that's equal 90 over 30 three times 0.20 and that's equal 1.93 that's equal so it's correct thank you for listening